You may have read about the recent discovery of a new set of scripture scrolls which rocked the archaeological world. Because they were found in an abandoned salt mine, these scrolls came to be called the Book of Morton. Of course, we all know that a lot of details in the lives of biblical characters never made it to the pages of the Bible. Fortunately, the Book of Morton fills in some of these blanks with some exact quotations of some famous biblical characters. In the first section of the Book of Morton called Famous Last Words. Here are the famous last words of Lot's wife. Okay, so there's a little sin in Sodom and Gomorrah, but what's the worst that could happen? The famous last words of Noah. Sure, Lord, if the weather's nice, I'll take a cruise for a couple days. The last words of Samson. Just take a little off the side. Jacob. Okay, Lord, I'll wrestle. But just one round. Jacob's youngest son, Joseph. Boys, did you ever wonder what life would like without me? Moses. Aaron, if I'm not down from the mountain in a couple hours, get them busy building something nice with the gold. Joshua. Fellas, a brass action like that, our next gig will bring the house down. Goliath. Okay, so the kid sings and dances, what else can he do? Solomon. Sure, why not? What's another wife, more or less? Elijah. Nice chariot, Lord. But why are the horses wearing asbestos? John the Baptist. Me? What could I possibly give Herodias's daughter for her birthday? Peter's psychiatrist. You know, my boy, you have a problem with denial. Paul? Damascus? A blind man could get there. Morton's Latter-day Proverbs. Only three things are certain, death, taxes and there's a sale at Circuit City. Vote not, lest ye be called for jury duty. The whiteness of the windshield is directly proportional to the size of the bird. The PA system in church is always two decibels quieter than the child in the pew behind you. The other checkout line always moves faster. The best two TV movies of the week will always be shown on the same night. The man who wrote the instructions for using your VCR formerly folded roadmaps. If the televangelist smites you on one cheek, turn the other network. Do not store up for yourselves treasures of this earth. But store up for yourselves frequent flyer mileage. Blessed is the man who finds the hair before the first bite of his hamburger. Blessed are the poor, for they shall get by with Form 1040S. Blessed are the vice presidents, for they shall supply endless material for stand-up commas. Blessed are the savings and loan executives for they shall see South America. Blessed are the computer illiterate for they shall not know virus. Blessed are the childless for they shall not need Reebok pumps or roller blades. Blessed are those who patiently put up with these proverbs, for they shall see an end to them. Morton's latter day prophesies, you will know that the end is near when you need to take a second trusted loan to buy popcorn at the movies. You will know that the end is near when Gay is no longer something Christians want to be. You will know that the end is near when. The employees in Chinese restaurants are all Mexicans. The two most common names on the freeway are Smith and Wesson. Condom is more popular than condominium. Tragedies from a skyjacker is less likely than from someone going through nicotine withdrawal. Your car speaks better English than the people who built it. Marital squabbles about money and sex are less frequent than those about who gets to hold the remote control. Word leaks out that the secret sauce is really 1000 island dressing. Here ended the wisdom of the Book of Morton. Based on a play by Bob Snook. Conditions for use, do not sell any part of this script, even if you rewrite it. Pay no royalties, even if you make money from performances. You may reproduce and distribute this script freely, but all copies must contain this copyright statement.